What's going on everyone? Uh, in order to start off, this video is not going to be like the normal ones. Uh, I'm actually not going to have the Mustang in this one. Uh, what it is, is I uh, I was online. I've been shopping for a... Uh, it's called a gyrocopter. I don't know if any of you are familiar with it. But it is... It's kind of like a helicopter. It has blades on top. But it also has a motor that pushes it forward with propellers too. Anyways, like I said, I've seen one fly here probably five years ago at least. And I always wanted one. And uh, I was just kind of browsing online the other day. And I happened to see one pop up for sale. So I just kind of threw a low ball offer out there. And, uh, and they took it. So I kind of got locked in into buying it. And it's pretty far from me. It's actually from Maine, which is about a 20 hour drive from me. So at first I decided that I was just going to drive this truck up there and uh, take a trailer, pick it up. And uh, then I decided I didn't want to drive that far. So uh, I went ahead and booked a flight and decided I'm going to rent a U-Haul in a trailer and just haul it back that way. But the rental price for the U-Haul in the trailer was like $1,700 because it was so many miles. And I decided I didn't want to do that either because I knew as soon as I get back, I obviously I'd be out that money. So. I have decided I'm going to buy myself a vehicle and a trailer there and try to haul this thing back, uh, which I'll attach a picture of a gyrocopter here so you can see it. I've already found a trailer. I've been browsing the Facebook marketplace up there. I found a trailer and uh, I'm probably going to maybe Uber out to find a vehicle to buy or to find one. I've been messaging quite a few guys already from there. I haven't really found anything as far as the vehicle to buy up there. So uh, on the way up there, I'm still gonna be browsing and uh, I'll see what I can find. I don't expect it to go smoothly at all because I've got to, I'll be landing at the airport with no vehicle or hopefully I have one lined up by then, but who knows, I probably won't. And uh, we'll see how this goes. I made it here to the airport, so uh, I've got about 45 minutes before my flight leaves. So I'm gonna get in, go through security, and uh, make sure everything goes smoothly, and uh, then we'll be out of here. So, uh, and uh, I've got a one hour layover in Washington, so uh, I'll probably see you there. That would be me. I'm here in the plane, so uh, I should be leaving here in around 30 to 35 minutes. Forty-five minutes later and we're finally going down the runway.
We've just started descending. It's been about an hour and a half or so. So we're coming down to land in Washington. And uh, then of course I head out of here and go on to Portland. I made it here to the Washington airport where I've got the one hour layover and uh, it's about 45 minutes before I get on my next flight and that goes directly from Washington which is here to Portland, Maine. Uh, and I've got the trailer and everything together already. Uh, I've got a guy I'm going to pick it up from but I have not found a truck to buy yet. I found a couple different ones but none of them that could uh, show it to me in time. So still looking around and I hope I can find something soon. We are number three for departure. Flight attendants, please be seated for takeoff. here in Portland now so uh, we're coming down for a landing. I made it here to Portland here in Maine so uh, I've got a guy on the way here with a F-150 that I'm supposed to be buying. So uh, he'll be here in about an hour, but till then I'm gonna go grab something to eat and uh, see what else I can find to do here, get some charge on my phone, and uh, we'll see how, or what condition this vehicle's in. I don't think I'm gonna get the F-150. It's got more issues than I thought. Uh, he's been sending me more pictures, but I've got an Uber on my way here. Uh, in a couple minutes I'll be here and I'm going out to look at another car and uh, I could always add a hitch on the back or something. So we're gonna take a look at it. I think that's my Uber right up there. It's one of those cars coming over here. I'm just not sure which one it is. Come over here and see. Yep, that's it right there. I'm with my Uber driver now. So uh, we're on our way to go look at this BMW. It's about five miles from here. Chapter 11 Furniture on Brighton Avenue in Portland. Here's the second car I came to look at, but uh, I looked underneath and it doesn't have any place for me to add a hitch on. So I've got another truck lined up, so I'm going to call my Uber back and uh, head over and take a look at the next one. I got an Uber ride and came back to the airport again and uh, I had to get some charge for my phone so I'm going to plug it back in and uh, look around some more and see if I can find something here pretty soon. So we've, let, we've uh, left the airport now 
and uh, the scooter guy ended up not showing up so I didn't make that but the guy that had that trailer lined up that I told you guys about earlier he actually ended up coming picking me up at the airport and we went and looked at another F-150 and it was actually a pile of junk so we're on our way to look at a uh, I think a trailblazer now and uh, we went and grabbed some food and everything so I cannot thank these guys enough for coming picking me so let's see what we find <laughs> 